Hey, welcome guys. Today we're going to look at the Sisadar market and the Tamarin market in Waihin. Uh, first of all, we'll look at the Sisadar market. As you can look on here, uh, it's got lots of different food here. There's lots of different stalls here. If you walk around, you can have a look now at the different stalls uh, available here. Uh, mainly, I think things, people just selling, little stalls selling things, knickknacks. Uh, there's bits and bobs of food here as well. Uh, drinks you can buy. I say lots of different just stalls you can just have a wander around. Uh, uh, but we're just having a look here first before we go on uh, to the Tamarind Market where we're going to get some food in a little bit. I uh, say so just still looking around here, just lots of stalls, lots of places you can get drinks and food. I didn't actually film the food there, but there's uh, quite a bit of food you can get Ooh, there lovely, as yeah. well. Okay, let's go and have a look at the Tamarind Market. So this is the Tamarind Market. You can see on the sign, it's open Friday, uh, Saturday and Sunday and the times are there. So we're looking for some food, have a look in here. Now, this is a great market to be honest, found it a few years ago actually. Uh, you can get absolutely all different types of street food here. Uh, there's wine available. There's lots and lots of Western food, as you can see in a minute. We're going to have a look. So for, first of all, just have a look at some of the Thai food there. I mean, all different types of Thai food, seafood. There's there. I didn't film it all. There's just so many different types of food there, to be honest. Uh, but I was really looking for like Western food there. As I say, there's some ribs there and some octopus here and... Uh, let's move on and have a look at this one here, this hot dog stand, which is great sausages they have here. I've been here before. It's really, really nice, to be honest with you. I'm going to come back and have this in a bit. Uh, these are fantastic. We've got the prices here for you. Have a look. They're really good value in this uh, market. It's really, really cheap. Uh, you know, it's market prices for the food. So, you know, you know you're not going to get ripped off. You know, prices on everything. So... Uh, it's a great market to be honest with you for food. It's awesome. Here's some barbecue chicken And then we found some Australian flame grilled beef cubes $1.99 I think they were for a plate. I've had them before they're cool. They are they're nice And then we went to there's there's a traditional pizza place there. Yeah, I'll have a look at the prices here guys uh, Just to show you so you know kind of how much they are. It's yeah, just reasonable prices nothing too expensive Everything in the market's good price, good value. It's a proper, uh, got a proper stove there, you know, as you can see here. And then moving on to another one. This used to be actually a burger place, but it's changed now. It's a pork chop stall here. So pork chop, is it what, 240 Yeah, for a pork chop. I didn't try that one, so I'm not sure if that's good or not. Uh, some, I say some ribs here, just so many different types of food. So we went back to the hot dog store because we, me and me, stepson fancied a hot dog. So yeah, here we are enjoying the hot dog. It was uh, really, really nice as usual. We've had it before many times, to be honest. Uh, really lovely down here in Waihin. And we had pizza too as well. My other son had a pizza. Uh, so we filled that off. So yeah, that, that's kind of it from the Tamarind Market and the Cicidar Market. I think Tamarind Market's better for food. Okay, guys, I'll leave you with the lovely Frankfurters. They're beautiful, they are. Until next time, guys, see you later.